Okay, so somebody just asked about the um, the fancy font thing. So I'm going to log on to my personal Google account because I already have it connected to my school account. So if your school blocked it, log on to your personal account and you can just copy and paste from there. Okay, so now we are about to go to the web store and grab that. So we can either go to the web store here or go on um, to your Google Drive and down here at the bottom right you will see the web store. So I'm going to go there and extensions, I believe it's called um, Fancy Font. So we're going to do a search for that. So I hope this is the same one that I use. So we're going to check and see. All right, font generator. We're going to add that extension. So it looks like it's right here. OK, so that's how you add it. Um, uh, so if you need to to uh, if you need to put it back up here, go ahead and manage your bookmarks or your extensions. OK, so now we're going to jump on over to my school account and show. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to show you what to do if you do not find it up here. So there's your extension tool. What I would do is make sure you pin that right here. Um, OK, so that way you can always have it right there every time you're typing and it's super easy. OK, so let's see what this um, let me show you how to use this. So we're going to edit this and um, let's let's take a look. Let me uh, title this something different. OK, so let's go over here. We're going to grab the fancy font and then I also have a symbol one. So we're going to grab this and I'm going to type in um, 504 requirements. So I'm going to scroll through here. There's not a whole lot. Um, I always do pick, I don't know, this one might be a little different. There's one that I kind of like. Usually it's in colors and things. So all I have to do now, it's copied um, to my clipboard. So I'm going to go in there and edit it and control V, paste it. And then um, you can do make them bold and all kinds of different things. So like this verification form, that's actually a different font in itself. So let's try another one. This trial one, control X. Let's go grab a fancy font and we can put, uh, I kind of like this one. We're going to say this is a test for demo. All right, so I'm going to grab that. I've copied it. So now I'm going to come down here, edit it, paste it, update it. So that's what it's going to look like. You can do that. It's HTML coded, so you can do that with just about anything. Um, you could even do it on Facebook. It changes it a little bit, but there you go. That's how you add a fancy font. Oh, you can also do this like with the symbols. Um, <clears throat> Let me try something real quick. We'll do these right here. So hang on just a sec. So this is called um, basically an emoji keyboard. So what I'm going to do is I am going to add an emoji to here. All right. I've copied that. I'm going to come in here. Control V update. I've got my emoji right there. So you can play with it a little bit. And I am actually going to play with um, doing the colors different. I know there's a way to do that. So you can hop in there and tell us how you guys are going to make yours or liven yours up. Have fun.